I'm Doppler 10 meteorologist Josh Poland with a web update for this storm system that's continuing to work into central Ohio. We do have several weather alerts to pass along winter storm warnings for the pink shaded counties where the possibility is there for anywhere from three to eight inches of snowfall. The blue shaded counties, that's where we have a winter weather advisory in effect. It does include Franklin County and surrounding counties, generally one to three inches of possibility, but there's a really good chance we'll see rain for a good chunk of the afternoon into this evening, and that's going to limit snowfall totals. However, temperatures are going to drop in a big way tonight, so any wet roads have the potential to become slick and icy as we head into tomorrow morning. Now, wind is also going to become a big factor late tonight into tomorrow. We do have have wind chill warnings that go into effect tomorrow through Tuesday for the entire state of Ohio. We're looking at actual temperature readings below zero. You factor in wind between 20 and 30 miles per hour. It's going to feel at times like it's 30 or 40 degrees below zero by tomorrow night. We could see wind chill readings close to 50 degrees below zero. So this is dangerously cold air. It'll just take a matter of minutes to get frostbite in conditions like this. As we head through the morning into the afternoon today, going to see a light wintry mix developing better chances for precipitation to stay in the form of snow as you travel northwest of Columbus. As you work your way towards the I 75 corridor, that's where we have a better chance of seeing that snow. You you do notice some green showing up on the map indicating rain. I think there's a good chance for rain for the Columbus metro area areas to the southeast, looking at rain mixing with snow northwest of Columbus. Now, as we head into the evening hours, still looking at snow northwest of Columbus, rain lingers into the uh, first half of the night tonight for the Columbus metro area, starting to transition over to some snow by say 10 11 o'clock tonight, and we keep some scattered snow showers in the forecast into the early morning hours of Monday. So by the time all is said and done tomorrow morning, looking at around an inch, maybe less east southeast of Columbus. We'll go with one to three inches for the Columbus metro area. Again, most of that snow taking place tonight into early Monday morning. You travel northwest of Columbus, three to six inches of possibility in Champaign County into Logan County. Also into portions of Union County. You travel north into Wyandotte, Crawford, Richland County, three to six inches of possibility and then more than six inches possible as you get even farther to the northwest into places like Hardin County and Allen County. Here's what we're expecting tomorrow morning. Morning lows in the single digits below zero, and this is going to be high temperatures for the day. We'll see falling temperatures through the day tomorrow. By the afternoon, temperatures just about everywhere below zero. Again, factoring in that wind, it's not going to feel nice at all out there. Maybe some flurries, light snow showers east of Columbus tomorrow morning. That works out clearing skies as we head into the day on Tuesday. So here's what to expect in your seven day forecast. Looking at a high around 41 today in Columbus, those temperatures is dropping big time tonight. We'll see a morning high of eight degrees tomorrow. Those temperatures falling through the day tomorrow. We end up about 12 below zero Monday night into Tuesday morning. Tuesday's high five and then another chance for some accumulating snowfall Wednesday into Thursday. Stick here on 10 TV.com. We are going to have another update for you this afternoon as we continue to track this winter storm working into central Ohio.